Northeast China has reported an outbreak of the African swine fever after slaughtering over 900 pigs in a scramble to contain the disease. African swine fever doesn't affect humans, but pigs, for pigs, is highly contagious, fatal, and has no cure. News of the outbreak has put Taiwan's agriculture authorities on high alert. Led by a beagle, this quarantine officer weaves through baggage claim at Taoyuan International Airport as the dog searches for the faintest trace of meat. Everyone knows about what happened in mainland China on August 3rd. We received notification that they had a swine fever epidemic. The virus of African swine fever can survive in chilled pork for up to 100 days and in frozen pork for 1,000 days. It was first detected in Kenya at the turn of the 20th century, and it results in death in pigs 100 percent of the time, as there is no known treatment. The disease spread from Africa and has been detected in Europe, South America, Russia, and now Northeast China, giving Taiwanese authorities cause for concern. Uh, we ask all our people, if you go to China, no matter which province you go to, we advise you not to enter livestock facilities. And if you go to the northeastern provinces, if you go to a related facility, you will be subject to quarantine and disinfection upon your return home. The Council of Agriculture said that African swine fever is currently not known to affect humans, although it can be transmitted from humans to pigs. Given the heavy flow of people between China and Taiwan, quarantine officers are treating the Chinese epidemic as a matter of concern, raising border checks to their highest level to prevent the disease from entering.